Michael Jordan's house in the Chicago suburbs has been on the market since 2012. Started at 25 million and it's down to 14 million 855,000. The place is nuts. Full size indoor basketball court, tennis court, full guest house, three bedroom guest house, poker and cards room, of course. He even offered a pair of every Air Jordans ever made for whoever bought the house. And property taxes are about 130,000 a year. The reason why people say it hasn't sold is because it's so custom to Michael Jordan, it would be very difficult and expensive to make it truly your own. I think that would be pretty cool. He even tried to auction it in 2013, but the minimum bid of $13 million was not met. So here's my take on it. If he really wanted to sell it, all he'd have to do is put up a decent piece of memorabilia. We've seen his jerseys, game worn, sell for over $10 million of late, and he's donated them in the past, and I know he still has some. So if he really wanted it sold, all he'd have to do is put up a nice game worn jersey. But another angle of it too is I'm surprised a company hasn't just come out and used marketing budget to buy the place for 14, 15 million dollars. The amount of value that it could add for a company like Airbnb to have that available. For the NBA to buy it and turn it into a museum. For the Chicago Bulls to buy it. There are a hundred companies that I could name that it would be pretty cool to have. So when a company buys it after watching this video, I hope you invite all of us to take some shots. If you enjoyed this video, follow for more.